hit his area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna be captain. So all oh, y'all wanna know what happened. I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. Feel like I'm out here by myself, but I'm not alone Designer don't mean shit, cause I got it on What a bad bitch, think she it, but she got it wrong Love it now, she calling on my phone I was destined for this shit, like it's written on a stone you know what it is, man? Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang, etc, etc Don't let none of that get too far ahead of you You know who I be, yeah, yeah, yeah Let's just get right to the topic Battle of the Bay, LA Shout out to Battle of the Bay Everything that they got going on my brother Showtime SP will be by later. We will be doing the recap, who won what, how we feel, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. You know what I'm saying? Because he's a vital part of this. And a lot of the times, you know, if we if his schedule doesn't meet up with mine at the same hour, we got to get up a little bit later. But we will be getting it done today. It's been a long day. I had to battle of the bay is on the West Coast time. So I went to bed about 1 o'clock. I had to get up at 4.30 to go to work. I, went, I got up at 4.30, went to work. Just got back now doing this, and then I'll get up with him a little bit later on. But you know, we're making it work. But uh, yeah, so disaster, disaster, disaster versus easy. So the battle happened, you know, disaster versus easy, great battle. We'll talk about, you know, the breakdown of the rounds or whatever the case may be, right? So in the battle, though, disaster, disaster calls out, calls out ARP, you know what I'm saying, saying that, uh, he tried to bribe Rex off the card, and if you with him, then F you and F them and something and do, do. He started wilding. When you start right, he started wilding on ARP. I'm not even gonna hold you, right? So it kind of was like it didn't make much sense because when I thought of it, I was like, why would ARP try to bribe Rex when Rex, first of all, he can't be controlled by nobody, especially by no money. That, that just don't even sound right. I've never heard of a scenario like that. Rex could never be bought. But his, his main guy is there, Big K. Why would he bribe him away from a situation versus this, this like this doesn't make sense. Like you gotta think of this here. If his vested interest is in Big K, who he done brought on TV, Big K was like rated like the number two person on the list that we had, and everybody's got him in there running. Why would he undercut what he has going on to bribe Rex off the card? I need one person in the car. <laughs> that's that's the first thing. There's <laughs> also why would he bribe him off the card to, to undercut Big K? This is crazy. Like, why would he do that? Like, you, nobody thought that far. Like, so, okay. So, Rex has this, I mean, Rex is bad. Rex battled Big K, great battle too. But this happened in the Diz versus uh, Easy to Buy Captain battle. He starts bombing on ARP. And ARP came out today and basically was like, yo, he showed the screenshots of the last context and situation that he spoke to Rex saying that Rex didn't know if he was going to be able to be on a secret battle because of his legal situation, whatever the case may be. But they were trying to like put him in a secret battle on Max out. And I was telling y'all, when I spoke to y'all, I was telling y'all, y'all doing too many battles, bro. Like, this shit is crazy. The card is already wild. Y'all got 10, 11 battles. Why y'all still trying to add niggas to the card? Ask ARP, did I say that? You know? Ask him, nigga. Did, did I tell you? Did I tell I said, yo, y'all niggas is still booking. Why are y'all still putting niggas on this shit? Y'all still out there calling Rex. Why you calling him for? Like, <laughs> this, this car was booked, my nigga. You was, you was, you was already at the bucket. You try to do a little too much extra, and you, you missed the layup. So anyway, so ARP goes through all of these situations where he feels like Rex either, you know, didn't do something in alignment with what he had going on or whatever the case may be. But now he finds himself in hot water. Not hot water, because a little bit. Because Easy versus uh, Diz will probably do a million, 1.5 or something like that. And that moment in the battle that he said this was a pivotal moment in the battle. Like, it was a big moment. Like, yeah, it got a lot of reaction, too. Yeah, because you wanted us to roll with you on this fuck URL shit. But they never tried to block one of my battles. Hey, RP tried to bribe Rex off this card. So if you riding with him, it's fuck you and fuck him. Both of you faggots suck dick. Both of you. you know, ARP got one of the biggest cards of the year. He don't want no narratives going on about him, right? And so... Uh, and then he went on to say, you know, I can sign that URL Summer Madness 13 contract and end your whole sh or whatever the case may be. And, you know, URL has got Summer Madness coming up, you know what I'm saying? I was just um, outside yesterday. I was hollering at one of my homies. And one of his favorite battle rappers is Av. Shout out. Uh, yo, yo. 
Me? Who your favorite battle rapper? I, I fuck with Av. Av? All body. I fuck with Av. Av? We murder anybody. Anybody? Step to the plate. You got Tay Rock coming up. I fuck with Tay Rock. I fuck with Tay Rock. <laughs> but um, it's gonna be a nice little. It's gonna be a sparring session. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. But Av might come out, yo, on, on top, yo. Yeah, nice, man. Yeah, yeah, it ain't all about the fucking the gun title shit. <laughs> you know what I mean? You gotta I come with that shit. Boy, nah, but I fuck with Av. Shout out Tay Rock. But I fuck with Av. <laughs> yeah, he said yeah, nobody no, moving no, you no, off no, Av. No, 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 I fuck with Av heavy, yo. <laughs> Remember, remember when he did that shit when he was like, yo, when he did the, the, he swooped over the shit like they skipped him out. Oh yeah, with a skip. Blah, 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 blah. Get the fuck out of here, yo. That app I fuck with. And before that, I fuck with app. Me, me the OG app, app from Flatbush, Brooklyn. I fuck with app. I yeah, do too. Yeah, stop playing with me. I'm gonna yeah. let him know. He gonna know about this shit yeah, too. I'm my boy now, yo. <laughs> Like, so URL definitely still has a lot of fans and fanfare, but back to the situation and topic at hand. So, the way it's sounding is like Rex was gonna be on Battle of the Bay. Everybody, and if you don't know, that flyer had came out with him on Summer Madness vs. Geechee, and that was a battle that people was talking about was supposed to be happening. So, I don't know if the battle had got booked or if it was in the running or it was about to be booked. I know that that was the rumblings, right? But I know behind the scenes, a lot of bloggers and a lot of battlers and a lot of people had, they didn't know if Rex was going to be in Oakland to battle Big K until uh, 15 Minutes of Fame put the video out. Like, that's the that's when they knew he was going to be there. Other than that, nobody knew if he was going to be in the Bay. I promise you that. I, if, if, <laughs> behind the scenes, nobody knew. You know what I'm saying? I think that Diz and all of them was going through it too. That's why it was like behind the scenes making phone calls and things like that. And... The way it's being spoke about right now, the people who know know I ain't in Oakland. I'm just telling you what was going on on my phone is that Rex probably figured that to throw that to them, you know what I'm saying, that he was being bribed off the car and not thinking that Disaster was going to take that shit and run with it and blow it all the way up, you know what I'm saying? And then um, Rex had called uh, ARP while he was on the live and I don't think he answered or uh, when I spoke to him not too long I don't think he called him back either you know what I'm saying like because it's kind of like quiet for that you know what I mean because he looking at it like if you're throwing my name under the bus you know what I'm saying to another league and then you got disaster the league owner who's gonna go out there he's gonna put it out there for the world like mother <laughs> F him and F y'all too but I will say this overall Battle of the Bay so far has been a pretty good event, you know what I'm saying? They had some really good battles on there. And like I said, I'm going to break it all down with SP later, but one performance I must say is B-Magic, man. B-Motherfucking Magic. He was wilding. That's all I'm going to say. Everything else will break down when we break down, but that 30 that he laid, that 30 that he put out there, man, Magic is, magic is just unconscious, man. But, you know... I think it was uh, the reason why, and the reason how I knew something was up with the whole Rex and uh, ARP. ARP don't care. That's why he put the screenshot out there, and he's letting people know vehemently that he did not contact Rex about bagging out of no battle, and he ain't trying to block no battle and no shit like that. So he wants the world to know that, and he, he was he was angrier than I really ever seen him before on <laughs> on YouTube. But he's like, nah, I'm not taking that. I'm not taking. I'm not gonna wear that. That I ain't do. You know what I'm saying? That I never told him to try to get him back out the car. And from what I'm hearing, it's not. He wasn't even the one that was sponsoring the battle. So why would he get somebody or try to get somebody to back out? But with all of that rhetoric being said, let's let's knock everything off the table that I originally said. Ask yourself, why the hell would ARP? Try to get Rex to back out of a Big K battle or bribe him out of a Big K battle that's going to put Big K another notch down when trying to get to all of these levels when it comes to winning battle of the year. Why, why would he count? That would be counterproductive. What did Emerson King? I put for thousands of substance and with the pound of substance and stacked it all up on the counter. I call it counterproductive. That would be counterproductive to cut your own artist's legs from under him. It would, make, it would not benefit them in any way. So when I heard that, I kind of was like, I need more, I need more. I need more. He got to give me more. Like, it can't just be what this bar is. But the question is, does Diz apologize? Does he say my bad, you know what I'm saying, when he finds out that it really ain't happened like that? Because he maybe, maybe the message was to deliver to Diz under the impression that he wouldn't come out and just go crazy with it, you know what I'm saying? But 
Yeah, he went, he, been, he went kind of wild, man. Shout out to everybody out there that watches this content. Dot Mob's in the news, and Rex had a really good performance that I want to talk about, you know what I'm saying? But like I said, I'm going to talk about all of this stuff later on in this week in Battle Rap with my brother Showtime SP. I think, you know, he, 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 got, he, got, he got some interesting dialogue about how he felt about the battles and things like that. And overall, you know, it was a pretty good event, two-day joint. So I think the second day is coming on today. You know what I'm saying? And there's some more battles on there. So it's like, you know, they got it popping out there. You know what I'm saying? For what it's worth, it was a, it's definitely a pretty good event. You know what I mean? To come out of nowhere and just pretty much put it back together, especially with a two-day car. Two-day cars is long. And then when you got events on the West Coast, I just remembered, I was like, man, they said 7 p.m., but that 7 p.m. is 10 o'clock here. So when, when it gets to like 8 and 9 and 10 for them, it's 1, 2, and 3 over. It's getting super late. So... We have to, uh, you know, just put it together. But overall, I definitely liked um, some of the battles that I saw on there. You know what I'm saying? But uh, Rex, yeah, I don't, you ARP, like, here's the thing. There are certain people in Battle Rap that if you say something about or blog about, they may not say nothing. They may not address it. They may not deal with it directly. Like, people like Loaded Lux ain't really that social. Like, he, like if you say something about him, he might not address it. Murder Mook might not address everything that you say about him, but when he does address certain people and when he has to, he's going to go in. Uh, Jay Mills, shout out to Jay Mills, man. I had seen him on the jump. Uh, Emerson Kennedy, he had to join. He was like, he felt like I don't, I always say he gonna lose, like I don't like him and shit. It's not true. Uh, I do be, like, I ain't gonna lie, a lot of the battles that you've been in, you know, I just feel like you haven't, you haven't been cooking like that. But, you know, John John joined. You was better than I seen you before. So hopefully, you know, you continue to do your thing. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, Hey, 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 I ain't mad, Mills. I ain't mad, I ain't mad, keep doing your thing. But what I was saying about like Rex, to see him in certain performances, you know what I'm saying, to bounce back and, and to be able to do the shit that he was doing, you know what I'm saying, I definitely want to talk about that later. But overall, like, ARP is the type of person, like what I was mentioning previously that said that won't, that won't address you. ARP will address you, you ain't see that? I just seen my name in the title of the blog the other day. He wasn't really addressing me from now. I ain't do nothing. You know what I'm saying? I only answered the call. The call came through. A, a, black, a battler was talking about what their situation was. I spoke on it. And, you know, he replied to it. But you think he wasn't going to address that? Did you think? Did you think? Do you think he's not going to address that? <laughs> he's, addressed, he's addressed more for less is all I'm going to say. He has addressed more for less. You gotta kinda like read the room. Like if you was gonna throw that alley, we should throw it on somebody else. Like, you know, my PO said I can't go. You should have, you know what I'm saying? You gotta do something like that. But when you do that shit with ARP, nigga, he got files on everybody. You know what I'm saying? I work I, I do my thing and I be blogging on all this shit. I guarantee there's a file somewhere on me and when he gotta upload, boom, we gonna George Bush the button and blow this whole shit up, man. <laughs> you gotta choose your fighter a little bit more wisely, man. But I like I said at the end of the day, I did hear about Rex and Geechee, but then I think that probably fell apart because Geechee's taking, um, you know, he's battling on the Riot Car versus Coffee Brown, and then uh, Rex just battled last night. But to be honest, a lot of people did not know whether he was going to show. Like, <laughs> that shit was not publicly known. I promise you, there was people the day of asking around, yo, you seen it? Is he there? Is he there? Is he there? He was there. Yeah, he did his thing too. So we'll talk about that a little bit later. But uh, yeah, man, I, you got to know who's going to go for that. I, I, that's the main objective of the message is like, you know what I'm saying? Like, there's a lot of leagues ain't going for that. Smack won't go for that either. If you threw him under the bus, he'd be right on there going in because he's not going to go for that because these guys, they work too hard. You know what I'm saying? Like, these niggas, it takes a lot to get to the top of any industry. And some of these names are the biggest names. And the last thing they're going to do, especially with big cards coming up, is play with their brands. And most of them, most when he was speaking, he was very, <laughs> I never see this nigga. Yo, calm down, AR, don't go get the AR, you know what I'm saying? I'm out of here. We'll talk to y'all niggas in a second. Gang, gang, gang. Bop. Feel like I'm out here by myself, but I'm not alone Designer don't mean shit, cause I got it on What a bad bitch think she it, but she got it wrong Love it now, she call 